What's up? What's good? Welcome to the show. It's your boy, Zillionaire. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Hit the notification bell to get alerts to all my new posts. Now, I want to talk about Paulicia, Dominic's baby mother, because I'm going to look at this case from all different angles. Okay? I'm trying to look at it from all different angles. Okay? When you when you investigate the case, everybody's a suspect until you can eliminate one by one. Okay? You never look at a case and automatically say, oh, uh, the mama had nothing to do with it. Nobody had nothing to do with it. You, you got to look at it from all angles, okay? I'm not saying accuse people, but you have to look at them as a possible suspect, okay? Or not just a possible suspect, or maybe they know something that they're not saying, okay? Sometimes people are, po are, are possible suspects or they know stuff. That they're just not saying. Now, Paulicia, I'm just looking at her violent behavior because she's already been to jail. She's been violent. She's on. She's on. Uh, she's on Facebook talking about she. she you know, she kill over the dick. I'm like, I can't. I, I can't get over these females nowadays talking about how they'll kill somebody over that dick. It blows my mind. And that song, that for the dick song, is one of the most ignorant. Ratchet is most disgusting songs I've ever heard in my life. To talk, that song talks about what women will do for the penis. And they're talking about they'll do anything for it. Kill for it. Like, it's crazy. And these females will actually hurt you and kill you over some penis. I can't get over that. I don't understand that. They'll, they, they put penis before their children, a lot of them. It's crazy. But anyway... I'm just looking at her behavior. It's very suspicious. Now, she's beefing, also had some beef with Camille Cupcake's mother before. Okay, they've beefed before. She has violent tendencies. She's played guilty to violent things. And it makes me wonder about her. Just from her behavior, her violent behavior makes me question, hmm, could she have some involvement in it? Could she have... Try to get the baby mama and the baby out the way. Because let me tell you something. You, you have women nowadays, some women, who will try to get rid of the baby because, so that the baby father won't have any more ties to the baby mama. There are a lot of cases where there are women, the new woman, the new baby mama, usually try to get rid of the mother or the child so he won't have no more ties to the baby mama. Just so she can have them all to herself. Hello, somebody. There are mo mothers out here, it's new, new girlfriends, new baby mamas that want to eliminate. So her behavior just leads me to believe she can be capable of anything. A person's behavior, tendencies, attributes, characteristics, past things they've done, stuff they get into, the way they talk, threatening other people. It makes you wonder. That's all I'm saying. Now, when, when you have cops and when you have investigators, when they're all investigating a case, they investigate everyone. Family, in-laws, exes, boyfriends, girlfriends, gangs. They investigate everybody. So either y'all, either somebody knows something or they're involved. That's how you have got to look at each case. Okay? People kill me when they give sympathy passes. When they give people passes and this and that, you, gotta, you, you can't do that. You can't just jump the gun on any case. You got to think. You have to look at every case and be like, "Hmm, huh, could the mother be involved? Could the father be involved? Could the ex be involved? To the could the current baby mother be involved? Could this be gang related? Hmm. You have to wonder. You have to look at cases from all angles. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm your boy Zillionaire. Just her behavior, her attributes, the way she talks, her violent behavior, just makes me believe she's capable of anything. Okay, some people, the way they act and their behavior shows you that, wow, they could, you don't know what this person to do. They're unpredictable. You know, people like that are very dangerous. 
That's all I'm saying. I'm your boy Zillionaire. Holla at y'all later. Straight like that. I hope y'all enjoying the holiday season. I might wait to go live one-on-one, -on -one, doing my one-on-one -on -one live shows with y'all. I may wait till after the holidays or if something else come up that I want to talk about one-on-one -on -one with y'all, then maybe I'll, you know, I'll probably talk one-on-one -on -one with y'all. It depends. All right. I'm out of here.